Hello and welcome to vlog number 48. This week is a very brief vlog. Probably the hardest vlog I've done so far. My mother, who is 83 years old and has been suffering from Parkinson's disease for the last 30 years, is now unconscious and nearing the end of her life. It seems to be a little melodramatic to say that she's given up the fight, but I think that that describes it. My mum never complained about the cards that she had been dealt, and that's why I never really appreciated what she had been going through, until I, too, developed Parkinson's and got a little first-hand experience. She never complained about muscular stiffness and weakness, nor the lack of energy, but battled on for many years, living alone in her little cottage with the steep stairs that she used to have to scale on her hands and knees, walking up and down the hilly roads in North Wales to visit her friends, not because she felt filled with energy, but in spite of the fact that she had very little. The last few years saw her condition decline rapidly, and my brother had an annex built to his bungalow for Mum to live in. She soon became almost totally housebound, struggling to walk, even with her walking frame, which she hated, frequently losing her balance and falling, breaking and fracturing a variety of bones along the way, and still never complaining. I remember when Mum was first diagnosed with PD and she broke the news to us. She said, Don't worry, I'm not going to turn into some dribbling, drooling wreck. Of course, she was wrong and became what she dreaded. When I was diagnosed in 2011, she blamed herself for the legacy she'd handed me. A ridiculous notion that, even if my PD had been genetic, she could have been held responsible for it. But we always want to protect those that we love, and I think she would have done anything for me not to have this damn condition. Over the last few years, Mum has had a number of events where she's been in a comatose or semi-comatose state, explained away by medical experts as Parkinson's episodes, on the basis that, apart from the Parkinson's, there was nothing wrong with her. Up until now, she's always recovered, usually within a few days. This time is different. She's been semi-conscious for over a week, and the last couple of days she's been unconscious. She's fading away before our eyes, and all we can do is talk to her, hold her hand, and tell her that we love her. She once said to me when she was having a particularly bad day, it's not worth going on, is it? I couldn't argue with her. And now I just wish her a swift end, no more suffering. Love you, Mum. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or have a topic that you'd like me to cover in future vlogs, just leave me a message in the comments and I'll do my best to respond. Have a great week. See you next Friday.